Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 38, and this is war number seven. And we're going up against an alliance called HC Sabretooth. All right, uh, let's see who they've banned. All right, Hercules, Ghost, and Human Torch. All right, let's uh, check out their defense. All right. Oh. Okay. That can be annoying. She can definitely be annoying. Um, Misty. And uh, Strife uh, shouldn't be too much of a problem. Uh, so, of course, Gallon, he is just amazing for that path. And if you hadn't heard, Gallon will not be touched. And they are aware of how good he is on this path. But they're happy with where he is. All right. So on node 24 here, we've got Mole Man. I don't think he's uh, difficult, to be honest with you. Hmm. Because Gallon can take him there, too. And, oh, Penny Parker. Well, well, well. Penny Parker. Now, the shock would be my concern. I'm trying to think. Does she? Hmm. Because normally, Gallon is perfect. A uh, perfect counter for her. Hmm. And we've got Silver Surfer over here who... I don't think is in particular a problem. So I might let, let's see. So Gallon for sure. Claire can do it. Definitely uh, I want Claire for here, unless I bring in a bleed immune. And for Penny Parker, while Claire can do it, I don't think she's the best for it. I could try Nebula on that. Nebula may still... Uh, I don't believe Penny is shock immune. Yeah, poison and incinerate. That's it. So... Yeah. Nebula should be fine. So Nebula, Claire, and uh, Gallon, uh, once again. Gallon for this one could work for that mole man. Hmm. I'm trying to think. I don't really have anybody in particular. Um, I mean, Nebula can do can do that fight right there with Silver Surfer as well. Nebula turns out to be quite uh, quite versatile. So uh, they're having us, uh, you know, call out which minis before we go in so that uh, everyone knows. Um, I don't know. Um... I can probably take Mole Man with Gallon. We'll we'll try that. We'll try uh Gallon uh with Mole Man and then I might let um my other alliance mate take out this uh Silver Surfer. And if he doesn't, I can most likely do it with Nebula. But I won't call it out. All right. Let's get on with the fighting. Guess who's back? Back again. Gallon's back. Tell a friend. That's right. Gallon is back in war. Kabam said they will not touch him. He is fine the way he is. Beautiful. Because he is a beast. Uh, he's easily uh, my favorite champ right now from this year. Uh, of course, you know, I love Quicksilver as well. He's also a favorite of mine. But Gallon... As you can see, 
is getting a whole lot more use, uh, especially since I take path three. And right now, I'm going to fight Miss. And oh my goodness, she is annoying. So I'm just doing the, the basic, you know, medium, light, medium, building up. You can already see she's purifying things all over the place. And something that I have noticed, and then look at this, she went unblockable. And I'm like, what, what? Why did you just go unblockable for some reason? But one of the things I've noticed about the purification uh, of, of when the AI is fighting, the purification, it's almost like an attack. Like, let me, let me explain. Look at this. Boom. That's done with her. Um, so I first noticed this with Agent Venom. The time that it takes them to purify, if they're going to purify, seems to be variable. So I'll like, I'll parry and I'll wait a minute. And if I, they don't, you know, pa um, purify or shrug off or whatever, I can attack. Then I noticed that that timing, as soon as I attacked, somehow they then purified and attacked me in almost one single move so that I could not um, do anything. I couldn't respond. Uh, this fight here, I wasn't too worried about uh, Strife. Uh, I was a little concerned about Misty with that unblockable and, and all of that, but um, <clears throat> Strife wasn't giving me any trouble. Uh, but I noticed that if I were to try and do it quickly, so I first tried to do a delay. So I would go, you know, parry, wait, wait, attack. And I would sometimes get attacked when I did that. They would purify and attack me. So then I said, all right, so if it's a delay like that, let me try and do it quickly. So I would do parry and attack, and I would still see them purify and attack me. Now, this doesn't happen all the time, but I'm sure some of you have noticed this. So basically, don't rely on that, okay? It used to be that we could. The AI is not fighting the same way as it used to. So these days, you gotta be careful if they can purify or shrug, just, just play them like they're stun immune or something. Do intercepts, bait out their heavy attacks, something like that. All right, so the middle is now cleared because I was not touching those guys in the middle. And next up, we get to fight Mo Man on this node. And I've not fought Mo Man with uh, Gallon on this node. So I was curious to see, you know, how he does. So, you know, boost up and everything, you know, not huge boosts, just, you know, a little bit of a boost. It, it I don't even know if it makes that much of a difference, to be honest with you. Um, but I do. Now, you'll notice that Gallon is hurt. And I haven't been buying um, health potions. That team health potion, you see it's the last one. That one was from all the way back when Kabam gave us a bunch of those because I don't use them very often. And so I was looking and I was like, how many? And I was trying, I was like, no, that one's too small. And I was like, okay, let me just pick up some. Forgot that you can no longer really get that. Um, there are some, but you can't really get the ones that I was looking for. Um, that's why you saw me, I, I was scrolling down and, and there is a, um, a health potion, which I probably will start getting. And then I went over to the loyalty and was like, is it, is it over here that I was looking for? Yep, there they are. See them? The single uh, level four health potions. And it takes loyalty, which is now much more valuable. However, the only thing that I've ever been getting from loyalty store has been um, the awakening gem. Now, mind you, it's an awakening gem crystal not even a generic. And I've already gotten two from there. But just recently with Cyber uh, Weekend or week since it's lasting a week, I was able to pick up three generic six star awakening gems. So at this point, that awakening gem from the loyalty store 
isn't really that um, desirable. So I will probably start just a little bit at a time buying some health potions so that I'll have them because uh, I'm not spending uh, units. All right, so we've got him up and I probably could have done this fight with him at that um, health, but I didn't want to risk it. All right, you see how he's purifying and you remember what I told you before. All right, so you see me doing that a little bit here. I got caught there, uh, that was just me uh, mistiming it. All right, but see, I'm, I'm baiting out the heavy attacks. Not gonna hit into his block, that's for sure. You see that? I waited, I was just like, nope. I already know you're gonna do that. All right, here we go. Medium light mediums. Just playing him like he's stun immune a little bit here. Fire off my uh, special three which will start the harvest. And really, it's over with for him unless I really mess up. All right, so we came down, all right, so there you go. Now you can see I'm, I'm uh, unstoppable, but I needed to bait that special out. All right, there we go. And I'm just trying to build all the way up to a special uh, one. Here we go, boom, and skadoosh. It's over with. Uh, one of the things that I am trying to do more often uh, is when I get the special one, I don't have to wait because it's unblockable. So is his uh, special two. And I'm unstoppable. So I can just flow right into it. But he was down, did not do too much uh, damage to me. Although I'm happy that I healed up because I would have been uh, much lower. You can see where my health is. And so I'm glad I healed up. Um, probably still would have been able to do the fight, but it would have been a little bit more dicey. Now, this guy here, I always hate him because he fires these heavy attacks from across the screen. And you'll, you'll I mean, he, he intercepts with heavy attacks, okay? So right here with Claire, I'm staying in Curse of Blood because if I don't, that bleed will wreck me. All right, now I pushed him to a special two because I didn't want to deal with that special one. All right, so that was the only reason I did that. And we're just, we're getting him down. Just have to take it slow, look at that, heavy attack. And then here's that special one that I didn't want to deal with before. So now I need to wait it out a little bit. All right, just wait it out, wait it out. All right, now we can go back in. All right, and boom. Now at this point, look at it, heavy attack from across the screen. Now, even if he had fired off his special one, I could have still finished him. I would have finished him before that phase would have been over. So I wouldn't have taken any damage. Um, but yeah, you saw that heavy attack that he did. Just, just from across, you're just coming across and he's just like heavy, just in case you tried to intercept or, or rush at him. Very annoying. All right, so now I was going to do gallon against penny parker but i don't want to heal up and i thought that uh with the shock uh nebula should be able to do this fight you know pretty easily uh and i think uh the mini was already taken so i had no need to you know hold out or preserve uh nebula here um who did i say before <laughs> but yeah nebula uh, so, with the shock, she should be able to do this. Uh, I'm just building up, as you can see here. Um, I hit into her block just to try to get some space. All right, here we go. Bam. And then, boom. Couldn't get to a special two because I had done, um, hit into her block earlier. So, I got power burned, but doesn't matter. All right, so, that was my contribution to this war all the fights that i did and uh we'll be back and you'll find out how this war ended and we're back and as you can see we won this war um good going uh, hc saber uh they fought well let's take a look here now i don't know why we didn't have full diversity i don't not my uh not my thing as you can see the fight you know was pretty close and uh congrats to our mvps there 
Um, but yeah, this was a close, close war. But we got it. All right. So that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.